Ladies and gentlemen, welcome. Today I'm doing a small update on this uh, single phase generator setup. As you can see, it is already running. And like I stated in the previous video, if I find something funny or cool, I will show you. So here it is. Um, here you will see a uh, yeah, a circuitry I had thrown together. But basically what it does is this is a air core generator 24 coils all of them are in series all of them are air core and it makes the system speed up on the load here I have I'm gonna short it over here on the EC side I can short it over here on the DC side I can put a 1 watt load on the AC side and also a 1 watt load so on the DC side there were a bit of juice in there <laughs> anyway uh, where was I uh, oh yeah and whether I um, shorted loaded shorted or loaded this um, the effect is the same now I'm running it as always at say 15 volts running around 600 milliamps and the RPM is not that much 728 now I'm gonna short it on the AC side I will put at the end of the video a schematic on this diagram over here for those of you that want to play with it and just you know, fool around with it maybe you will find a use for it or not but uh, from what I've seen till now, I will say it's uh, yeah, it's nice, but uh, pretty use, um, yeah, useless. Anyway, it is shorted on the EC side, and the RPM was um, 726, and the RPM is now 1000 to uh, 1030 something climbing. I'm gonna remove the short on the EC side and I'm gonna load it with a 1 watt LED lamp. As you can see, nothing spectacular, just a 1 watt load. On the EC side, the DC side is still not connected. And the RPM is 1047, 48, still climbing a little bit. So yeah, nice. Now I'm gonna uh, put the DC load on it, remove the EC one. As you can see, the EC load and and short are completely open. Only a uh, one watt uh, DC load, nothing spectacular. And what is the RPM again? 1077 and climb a little bit and the input was 600 milliamps before and it is now down to 400 milliamps and if I short the DC side but well, like I said in many videos before shorting your output doesn't say anything because you can't do anything with shorting with a short you have zero output. This is uh, for me. Is it uh, yeah a waste? Not a waste, but a use uh, useless test to do. I'm not interested in uh, the system speeding out while short, but while on the load. It is now shorted on the DC side, and the RPM is. Yeah, kind of the same. So yeah, cool. Open the short back up. Give me a second. Don't want to shock myself again. Now it is open on the DC side, open on the EC side. And the system is slowing down. You can even light up uh, a uh, one of those uh, neon bulbs, as you can see over here. Yeah, you can see that. You can also light it up on the DC side. 
which is over here. Nothing special. As you can see, the system slowed down again. It is now at 400, and yeah, you can see it's slowing down pretty fast actually. Oh, so, yeah. Any input, once again, is around 600 milliamps. Oh, okay, that's about it. Like I said, I will put a schematic of this in the uh, at the end of the video for those who want to play with it. Just two identical transformers, two identical uh, toroids, a cap here, a cap there, and that's it. And you got that effect. It is nice, funny, and cool effect, but pretty useless in my opinion. Anyway. Um, Hope you enjoyed it, and as always, 